As this session begins, I know many are excited to turn the page on 2020. However, I believe that when we look back on last year, we will see a year that brought out the best in Nebraskans. We began the year with high hopes of moving forward as we recovered from the historic floods of 2019. But 2020 was interrupted by a new and unforeseen challenge, the coronavirus pandemic. Nebraskans took on this new challenge with the same spirit we have for generations. We rolled up our sleeves, put our grit, tenacity, and determination to work the Nebraska way. Through it all, Nebraskans have been using our tools to slow down the spread of the virus, such as social distancing, wearing a mask when we go to the store, washing our hands off, and staying home when we're sick. As we all do our part, the state has followed our North Star, protecting our hospital capacity. Over the last 10 months, we've pursued this goal by using our six pillars, testing, contact tracing, providing PPE, making quarantine space available, protecting at-risk populations, and using directed health measures. Time and again, history shows Nebraskans respond by doing the right thing, and the pandemic has been no different. Our health care workers have stepped up heroically to keep Nebraskans healthy. Data shows the Nebraskans stayed home when we asked them to last spring. And now Nebraskans are embracing the coronavirus vaccine. Thanks to the individual contributions of countless Nebraskans and our six pillars, our state has successfully ensured that everyone that needs a hospital bed, ICU bed, or ventilator has had access to one. This approach has helped to strike that balance between slowing the spread of the virus and allowing people to live a more normal life. Even as we've had to overcome the challenge of the pandemic, the work of Nebraskans everywhere has kept the state of the state strong. 